watching tips for technicians i'm tad today we're talking about how to check a capacitor a capacitor stores accumulate electricity and it helps the motors run uh, this one right here is called a dual capacitor it's got three terminals uh, labeled common hermetic and fan okay fan is going to be in the 5 to 10 microfarad range on residential equipment and then on your hermetic terminal to your common you're going to have around 30 microfarads to upwards of 80 microfarads now I'm going to show you this um, capacitor and my multimeter. I've got it on microfarads. That's the way you're going to check it. If it reads zero and it's rated for 45, then um, it's bad. So let's check this out. Come on. So I have a hermetic terminal. I've got a fan terminal. And then over here, I've got my common. Now, when I check from, for the compressor terminal, it'll be for, from common to hermetic. Right here, we have a 45 uh slash five microfarad capacitor and when i turn my multimeter on microfarads uh, to check the capacity it says 45 45.24 you see that so i'm checking my compressor and i do that by putting one side of my meter lead on a common terminal and then the other on hermetic now you have to make sure that the terminals are clear of the wires so what i've done is i've taken one of the terminals which is common the wire that goes to that uh, which is your common wire from your contactor and usually your common from your um, compressor i've taken the wires off there you can leave one side you can leave the wires on it'll still give you an accurate reading but you need to make sure that you take the wires off one of those terminals now i'm going to show you how i check the fans um, terminal i'm going to clip my alligator clip from one side of my meter lead onto the fan and then the other one is going to go on the uh, common now let's see what it says it says five five microfarads if you guys can see that uh, that is a short demonstration of how you're going to check your capacitor you're going to use your multimeter to check microfarads usually on the capacitor itself it's going to show you what it's rated for whether it's five microfarads or a hundred microfarads. You're always gonna go from common to hermetic, and then you're always gonna go from common to fan, okay? Uh, the common and fan goes to your fan motor. That's what helps run that. And then on the compressor, it's hermetic, okay? Guys, if you have any questions about checking microfarads on capacitors, and trying to figure out if they're bad or not, please comment below and I'll try to help you. Um, as far as the capacitor, usually this is what fails the most and it's most common on uh, service calls. You technicians are going to see this a lot. So make sure you know how to use a multimeter. Make sure you know how to check microfarads on a capacitor. Guys, thanks for watching.